ni do ni ule obe na be ba he mogomo u hopa sa de bi soktoi de kahal ho yawo de kahal nyare wo de kahal kurba wo u hopa sa de bi ha ba bonga bes ni ma hop ma pe u hopa sa de la ha be gbele ba lo mama mlen mama sen u hopa sa u din che ni ga bon bes enyu le bo ba pe ba kal bi le un hop u gbe be ma he ni le un la be ti mur bolo to ke na ye mbenge toli yi la ye ngomin u hop pa sa u ba un no men por ile ni ni e bi su bi ngong si won so ma ten ni ma long ma em lere Tolong lepas nak bawa, nanti bagus hek nak king nimkel bilul mekering em, inyule hendi king em yotama be yon bang em leh nano, nanti mak king macai ni cai debura bolum ne bonge babuk. Ba miso nwa pe pe bol. Ndi ba ma king ma. Ma no ga hana no. Ingen ene men porul. Inyule hop. Uye ndaye i ma king. I ba yomi. An la ma holos. Ne yig le bon map. Ikel ene ndaye. In la habe andal. Nwe ma king ma chai. Ndi chai di bot. Man lim. Ndi. Ngira. Babok. Panit me hino. Le me pahalene. Nkong hisi. Ma king map. Men labe hoya. Mbou li mout. Ikere li ten li basa. Ngira. Men si male li ten li basa. Men bigra. Ma ten ma pe. Ma yele yagbo. Ma king ma ma bok bap. Ma be li ve. Minjong iba lolo. Imbu li mout. Yele. Babi yele. Ban he mis ingwang lom. Lom nou ba lolo. Babi gwe le akil. Ipand. Ibon baba bahal. Mounou ipand. Ngen babi nyuga kimbongo wap. Ubon. Babi cho. Bama yiri yinis. Bongo. Mi ba bo. Abi yi gile bes. Mungo u ba lo lo. Won u bi ti ba jo le mungo u yi. Yak pand yap. Ba 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 hal. Ba ti yo jo le pand ma hol. Pand i ba sogol sogol. Ba be lugul mungo. Ba lo lo ba oyo jo le. Pand ndim. Ni pand i bangi yi. Bes, inde rebor, ima kwasi, jolbele, jibili lo haji, ilel, ibe babi yere le ngwang lom. Be ba debili le mamounu, imongo uba lolo, de kahal keri yom. Di ibe het ba lolo, manke na bes, ndi to pako, de ban be, inyo la chak mungo, ili bon jok jok, ndi to timbi wo, Ngwang uba sogol sogol. Mou ipand yimil inyen, men nounou men pourou be, me bak mengi yum lak. Mou ipand yimil inyen, men nirle y tambal mbok, iba lolo. Ilen mbok ba sogol sogol bem. Mou ipand yi, tokoro, itong oli omje, ndi to toun li pan, Ikeril emativ la. Me tar me bana habi. Njal ye gwel me. Tokon. Heb elen lolo. Aki chak mungo. Ili bong je nyen antep. Makobe me yom je. 
ndi to ema tibla ndi ini pand yon me bak me sev la le pand ma hol ndi me chom her mbul mut yegle ngwang lo uba sokol sokol me ya le rebo me no lo ya rebo kiri balolo bambal ya pand ba yik ses pand lo iba sokol sokol ba bi mbul mut yegle ngwang lo uba sokol sokol ayegle bi nyu ya chobi ni mala ba be lobo ko lom ba lolo ba korol go ba jubu go pande ya ba ba hal imbulu mudu yegle yegle njal ya be be benuk muno ipande ba sokol sokol bi kuri chai hinyule ini pande lom I be new go malip ba lolo ba be sehio. Mbulu mut i be yegle ngwang lom uba sokol sokol. To ba e ba matibla ba tehebe. Ini mbulu mut i ba ga kongok. Joga li pe yaga li bu wonjal ni makon. I be hibana de lema i mongo uba lolo. De kahal ke din yom. Ndi bana be kuruk inyo tong yom je to hia ya hia inyo matibla dekula bang muno ini pandlom iba lolo di kenek di kova soso kum ini kum ibanga mapo makengi maile di tabela di yal di lale yap ebe zvari lema mungo uba lolo. Behe de hong la gale de lo hawa makwasi. Behe ni banari yin kik. Inge mlom. Inke nga ni kum. Ma po ma omuk. Ndiri bana be pago. Ichak mungo. Pand de be hongo le ye pan mahol. Yil na be pand chiba. Ni pand nyen. Hana no ki nyang nyang be kenga bes dimbi grab lo buke di yek ngwang ulom uba sogol sogol mengem menti bes nembus din jel matem iye benduru inyu leto paro ibungul mongo nembudu bebe dimbi yek lo buke guya to mol map de yi habe mama so iboro londol bo yom ingi humbere be ikere making mama so gol so gol nje atol ni bes paro inyu bungul mongo ni bus pan lo me balolo ibe kulak e kengbak mengwang kenek besha hana no tongwang lom to wara de te habe e bale la bi ramol ma lo beke bi yele ngwang lom u ba sogol sogol bebek ki de bagle de leng londok bebek ki man no bes londok bebek ki man chol bes pago bebek ki ba leng yo Muno ipan lomba lolo. Bebe ki paro ya kulak, ikulak, ikulak. Iko wabe hana nge mukum kigiri en kigik. Amaten ne malong manko ngesi mani nge mleme. Ngang uman basa umbe na kil imangin. Ini nge nlom. Ni mungo mentib ke ne be. Iye inyo noho rabe le joga jes le ma hop Afrika. Ndi tobo tobo epe yes nkong. Ibi tiba jo le Kamerun. 
ma seri ki ki bole mungo un kik ingi kum ndi ibana be paro e bungu limbus ipe yem dobo dobo me yemalet nu anye ra ku hiyigil himao limbok imaten ma kamerun dimpe me yemalet basulu Baba Gwen son iniga bonga basuglu hop map ni mbogo yap ngira itabele me tongbe ndong i unu son ndinga na kabu kumul iye semek tole semek munu injelini yom me intik iyele njel iyigil isuglu Iba lolo, beyon in la torol tonyingi mahomis, ndito mboyes. Sulu, idingom bon bes, itabe sulu inyu holo mbok, iba sogol sogol bes. Halankov lale, tornyinga mahomis, ibi sulu iba lolo. Hiko hiwi, mahomis matu la be. Makunde yin, yinik. Higi long, yon in la matelep ni yon makirik. Ite mboye ni holos mamboye. Ijam me nigil munu nison wem, joli. Inyo hala nyen me nibalit pa hop ni mbok sahaba pe. Dibi yon makirik. Ibrul tilab kar bikeri ni hop wis. Jimmy Bot, Julison, Disibile, he called Bem. The Mapi Maya, Mabakar, my call Bem, ma. Jimmy Kibolo, Le, the Holo Makenge, Inu, Cobol Mahomes, Ipola Monomo, Hendiri, Ipola Pulasi, the Mahomes Bay. In Gang and Nidite, the Esan son. Uka hula epemes nkobol. Epola maporol maliten le basa pa timpo mo masona. Digwe ki borunge me kenge, ni ki yi le kenge, le long ni yo. Torgwe be pago inyo bungo le mongo wen mbus. Di le, de hula ekek, ma kerel, ma yondo. Ni nigi lela maten mape, mama ile bok, wangan mungo, ubu yung habo, maligi, turul making, mabasogol sogol bap, toi bale bok, pahendi, ingem long, gibis. Amaten ni malong, mesokha, ni tibi babaso na mayega, nyule na yamle hop, ibasogol sogol bem. Nehem le king iba stogol stogol bem. Tibe ma yega. Men so khan. Thank you so much, Emmanuel. That was a real joy to listen to. Uh, even just the English translation was a joy to listen to, but really the pleasure was in being able to hear the basa. Uh, and I think we have time for questions and comments from everybody. Uh, feel free to ask questions in English or French. I don't expect that anyone in the audience can ask questions in basa. Uh, so yeah, feel free to chime in. And uh, thank you also, Paul, for your interpretation. That was really wonderful to be able to get the message both in Basa with, with the English translation. Perhaps a first for any conference I've been to. I think it was a first. I haven't seen a talk in Basa at any event or festival yet. Uh, I, I have a question actually, Emmanuel, for you. 
Uh, what are some of the attitudes towards mother tongue education that you see in your students? And do you see those attitudes changing? Mm Wait, we heard that in Basa, but Paul is currently muted. Bon, mentimba, mentimba, timba, wembe, dimbe, on nule, le noir de poule. Mekale, mbale, la reso, wembale, il est, paouru bem, pagwebe makint. Toker la nime banga soule, ne bo. Jamlin tibebo makint. To a bed, Baba Bam Sulu Baniga Baiba lit Bon Yavan son, a pe, Niga Mahop, a pecky bo, Panya, or German, or Chinois. Your way, Lipim Gimangira Balir Bis Baiba Sulu Barajap, the Baiba lit Baba Sa, Tole Bayundo. Hala ina ima liga. Bebe boba so na be ndi joga jap. Thank you. Uh, we have a couple of questions from the audience. Uh, John Kelly asks, do families that once spoke Basa more commonly tend to learn French or English? So how you let him dimbe mbalga yonga? Yeah, I think the question is whether families who previously spoke Basa are now shifting towards French or English now. Your money will pull us in. You let Basa Bampura, a pehe Cameroon, Yele Pulasi on Yen Belion. You let Cameroon, the Kala Le Guebe Pepe Ba, Peyara, Gision Pura Yongada, any pehepe Pulasi on Pura, Basa Bain and Ganda, the Homa Pulasin Pura. Thank you. Uh, we have another question from Lilian. She says, thank you so much. When you say that in Cameroon, we cannot move forwards, we cannot move backwards. What do you mean and why? Ndi bon mem bam por be basa. U yele yele no hala bon mem bam por be basa. Nyu yem le ke sul yele bon mem bam por be basa. Dime le tem num bus yele la. Nyu por ne bon mem la ma por bon bo la ma por ne bo. Ye hala nyu le wa wem ataben basa. Bon. <laughs> Makebe mekalbe ma mandaviem libina di gandak imaha ni mandab mabot payihala John maliga ngongyes ibasang jogalingwe leba on baba nigil di ilom nunu mekalbe leri baba nyugabes akena bes alawe abihe bes Job Nigil Mahob Mape Litimbil Habe Halantombe Tolika Bissu Muller and Sobold, he left Pand Inni Ibab Nugabes, Itabebe Pand Mahol, Dinle, Itabebe Lam Ndi Matem Nimbus, Manly Rilbis, New Halen, and Purul Hala.
Do we have any other questions from the audience? Because I have so many questions. But yeah, in the meantime, I wonder uh, if there are any particular lessons that you have observed from other countries, other communities that you think would be most useful to Basa speakers or to Cameroonian languages in general? Yeah. <laughs> Mais on le jambe la ma bon ki ki bol ba pe bon et elle qui me calbe de telep de telep ma kora ki bon mana e bala mura nanga bananga nyel kora ki bolini akala yo man por hop we basta halan tombe de la ma yong telep longni nevele halen de kabo e bala no bon be hala dam la bunga be benga ke mem ki mem porha men tong me buk se la be me ndi balengi sion me poroto le pulasi ki me yeme me tongo le me no ho be jam men kal me tongo ya bo buk no ho be din la be ken bi suhala de kal be la hi ki muraye ne ho bu hala be en kal the lama nig lama hop mes ndi higi long higi mut an lama bananjel e bon mam long no hop we nduwi to bale an nigil hop pe jam le jon men kal Thank you. That's that's a beautiful perspective. Uh, and it's it's a pleasure to be able to hear language in use at events like this. Right? We're, we're all here to support mother tongues, not to hear exclusively English or French or Spanish. And so it's a joy to be able to provide that place where folks can bring their own languages. Um, we have another question. Is there interest in Basa songs and stories among people in Cameroon, even if they don't speak the language well? Eh, hala e maliga. Mahongo len gel pe i. Di ler bana. Inyo turul mahob mes. Inyo le ipon bes. Baban por habe mahob mes. Kalar le basa. Chembi de basa rin le melbo. Kalar mengang. Mengang menginga. Mi bangang al habe mengang. Inyo le mengang. Basol sogol bes ba be angal ba be angle mo ingi ba ho man bai di be de binyorelen di lotison bai ye ho ma yele bor ba be ba kor ba kokwa bor ba lolak nganda mandap ndi bitison bi di bilo ba hige mut aya yib ba kere ne pendje ne ngawe ne bonbe Hala anti habe pola le mengang mening. Ndi bebek ba le bon jele bak John Mankale ki yi le kenge a ila hola bes ibong le mengang ya wome tuwe. Ndi inyi chembi bonga ba wanda din le milbo bantub cho to ba le bantub yo mantub ki a be he beto bok bon gisi e bon gare no be yom ala be po abe abe kobla that's wonderful i wonder are there places online where folks can access Basa songs or stories if they're curious to, to learn from them themselves? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> 
ndek imu munu ikiyi eh ngel kiribo alura noye juli rintire na gombi ndi alura emere anke be longe ndi bale bomo yin ki koble be na no ki bebe ngang pe ma burul be eh maliga melens di lamgale gombi di korogwo di tirago di chamagwo isuglu ye meniga ibolo i menore salio lom ba urubem ba suglu mbe na ombo le bake ba o korol ba ba yon ni kebe mondo ba yon chimbi ba yon menan ba yon mangin eh ndi bebek din gwebe mahula long ni ber mala mahula bes ni ubong le bi ni gom bi bak binen ge bur ba bong la go ndi ni jam le li en sen nga dak I'm just reminding everyone that you are welcome to drop questions in the chat. Otherwise, I'm going to continue monopolizing all of the questions. <laughs> but I would love to hear more. Oh, there we go. Lilian uh, says, thank you. In your opinion, what can make Cameroonians change their minds about indigenous languages and start embracing them? It's a great question. <laughs> mon mala bongo le bahina nyu lengi mbor nga da bor ni nebe bele mura la kel koral keng un kongsi bor ba em le ganyen malong ba pen hopwe na hopasa bor ba nebe be hala nyu hala en men ti be nduru i ni le ni ni yong nduru ni nebe mele hala bonga ya pol a nebe hala le me por nbasa me be sombo le me por Pehye mungkwe ni basa, mbu melela ni pulasi, mesok ni gisi. Ndi mebete mekale to jam. Ber bampor ni gisi, bayi baburo ni gisi, bamal ni gisi. Ber bampor ni pulasi, bayi baburo ni pulasi, bamal ni pulasi. Ya kome mburo ni basa, mamal ni basa. Nye minti kaki mele, mangi raman lo. Me ba me kele kora. Me nye ek sabi me. Ndi me ba me tima hongo le ba le ban la tima pola. Le ba pot. Le ba sa. Nge ra bor ba pe ba te. Le yi ba sa ba la pora ma kora ma kengi. Yi yi muran la tongo li yi. An la tila ba ka. Muran la kumul bolo. Nye ule. An ni ga mam ni ba sa. Na hongo le mente me ma me on mi le me hengel bo ba bo ma nyu le me kal be le bes ba be be bes isuglu nyu le rupor ba sa hala angi bo malen to ba le ban be ba be bo ndi ban so nga bo nde ya ma ba mes ikola ba sa ni ba sa hala wen sang aye ba sa nyang aye ba sa ndi ban so nga bo ba le ba por bang ba sa Inyule, iber babi sahabe heba bonga. Babi, ngira mwen kale bo, meti abe me kale njom, yine ndigi, iber babi sahabe heba bonga, yak bes, ilen ini, di gwe njom, di gwe be soman, di lama sal, di lama bong mamma ile, man purul, inyuhalen, Nanti ki el pelong ni bor ba pe ba ba ilevan sal inyo torol inyo le hop hiru dental hop tabe yompe hop yendiri hop ye king iba sogol sogol di ilev torol yoh balerungus. Thank you. Uh, we have another question from Dan Duke. It says, great heartfelt talk. Can you tell us more about the language archive in Yaoundé? 
מאיר אדן, מאיר במלא איי אמלה מהם, כל מסילה איי אמלה. פה לא אימי למקל יריו, אי אטנגל, אין כבלונגה, מן לה באמת ג'וב כאילו דמול, די אין כבלונגה, די די אין מנג'לה די טוווליו, די מין ג'או מסונה די בטירה, מי אין טירה, די כאיון אין כבי נולה ברבה בלמה בונגוליו, ברבה בלמה תימה הולה, אין ניר בולוי בב בונג בן סון וואפ, נוהלן בולום כבי לונגה, מקלו הלא סם כבי. Oh, ati ah. Asha, I think Paul is having trouble with his internet. So, if we have any other questions, Emmanuel, I'm so sorry. You might you might have to answer in English if Paul's internet drops out. I hope not. Uh, but uh, I, I do, I would love to know about your work in technology for African languages as well. Do you want to tell us just a little bit about your goals for digitizing languages of Cameroon and why that's important? Uh, yes, now you're forcing me to, to speak in English and people are going to think that I, I have been torturing them not to be speaking in, in English. Uh, okay. But yeah, um, as I said, I started my work uh, with an archive, with a language archive, uh, but the archive didn't get the necessary support from the organization where it is hosted. I should say where it was hosted. So eventually we had to move the data into a different, cloud uh, storage space in South Africa at Sadila. So this is where the data is being kept. Currently, we are working with um, a heurist, which is uh, a database infrastructure, uh, our project, but it, it is hosted by Human Noom. I think most of you might know about it. Uh, we are now uh, trying to deploy the archive onto this um, cloud space. Now, speaking of my personal engagement with technology, I, I think the experience of the contact which I had with language in, uh, documentation and Dan, I'm lucky to have met Dan because he is really uh, the architect of my, well, in most part, in, of my current destiny. Uh, he may not know of it, but let me let me tell it to you, Dan. Uh, meeting you has been a blessing, and it led us to work on the documentation of Bacola, where I got the experience with technology and with archiving, etc. So that got that had a very uh, I mean, a significant um, print on my perspective on language. So I believe in technology, in the power of technology to kind of uh, take us to the steps where the books and the schools, and you know, when I talk about the school, if you listen to my talk, you know what I'm talking about, where the school has led us. So actual, uh, presently, I am very much involved with digital humanities, language documentation and archiving just being, uh, let's say a branch or a sub domain of it. And if you really want to know what about my, my, my project, I, I will be hosting uh, a training program in March from the 21st to 26th. The first digital humanity uh, school for French speaking Africa. We are currently deep into the preparation. We are going to welcome 44 participants from uh, nine countries in Africa, French speaking Africa, because English speaking has 
their schools, Nigeria, South Africa, elsewhere. So something needed to be done for French Africa. So I am one of the lead person behind this project with Professor Elizabeth Burr from Leipzig University. So we got a grant from Volkswagen. And then you remember Volkswagen, we got our grant uh, to document the uh, Bacola from Volkswagen. So I'm still somehow with them 10 years later. And uh, yeah, uh, and in my teaching, I, I, I try to advocate the use of technology for teaching, for, for bringing another flavor to teaching as opposed to making teaching uh, something that is a burden to the students, to the learners, making it something that is enjoyable. I am of the opinion that we don't need to pipeline the teaching of our languages into the same channel of schooling that we inherited. We can make it a playful experience, a joyful one. So technology is a good, uh, you know, good solution for that. Thank you. Yeah, that's that's a beautiful echo of what Kelly and Dawn said at their talk yesterday, that language teaching and learning can be joyful and fun and sometimes even humorous and, and bringing that joy is a recipe for success. Uh, we have a question from Friedrika. How do you see the role of scholars from the global north in the development of African languages, if they have any? Um, I don't want to sound I don't know. I, I don't. I don't want to. Um, but I think they. Well, they have been helping people from the West, of course, with very good intention. Have have been well helping. I mean, Dan, SIL, other scholars. But see, see where we are. Look at where we are. Where does that take us. I believe nowhere. Not because those who come from outside do not really have the intention of helping, but I think they usually come with a different perspective. John and other and, and Frujik and maybe other people who have some experience in, with Cameroon, look at the damage that the general alphabet of Cameroon language is having. This is something that I belief that was brought in by outsiders, that we should write the languages with an alphabet that will be closer to the phonology of the language for purely scientific reasons, uh, which has not led to literacy developing in any Cameroon language. Yet this is something that is being pushed by organizations such as SIL, by the government, because when the government is looking for counseling, they go to SIL and what SIL tells them, they take it you know, for heavenly truth. So uh, I don't want to be mean to you guys who have been helping, but I think we Africans, we have to do the job. No one is going to do it. Thank you. I think that that's, that's good for all of us to keep in mind. Yeah, there's, there's support roles perhaps that outsiders can fill, but the real work has to be done inside the community. Would, would you agree with that? Uh, sorry, I didn't get that. Oh, sorry. I was just saying that, that outsiders can, can fill support roles under the direction of people in the community. But... Oh, absolutely. Maybe, maybe I wasn't very diplomatic in my answer. <laughs> but what I mean is that the local people should, be, should take the leadership or at least they should be involved, full-fledged. Uh, look at language documentation, which is a great enterprise, but of what use is it for the people whose language is being documented? I mean, from my experience of none, because this is something that was uh, theorized, elaborated, from outside, and then the outsider is giving his money. So if somebody is holding the purse strings, he's the one deciding. So the consequence is that 
we Africans, let, let me be blunt. We do, we, we apply for funding because we, we need some money and, and, from, and some, uh, you know, and promotion. We need to publish. We don't always care about the language, not the community. And this is because attention is not uh, paid to what is real, what, what lies at the heart of the social need of the people. So, yeah. Yes, thank you. Uh, we have another question from Alexandra. She asks, do you think there's value in collaborating with speakers of other indigenous languages in Cameroon? Uh, <laughs> sorry, so uh, my Basa has, I am tuned to Basa, so I need some rewinding to, to get back to it. Can you take back? Yeah, so Alexandra asks, do you think there's value in collaborating with speakers of other indigenous languages in Cameroon? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. This is the key, and and, and for one one reason, which again uh, usually uh, brings me at odds with my colleagues, I don't believe much in the notion of language. I mean, what is a language? Where is Basa? Where is a Wondo? Where does it start? I don't believe in atlases. So, and this is another problem because we have been led to think of our language experience as something reified, as some reified reality. Whereas I believe our language tells, tells us about our historical connections with the others. Now, when we are writing a grammar of Basa, what we do we do? We go and collect language on Basa, describe them according to rules that work for us, of course, but do these rules tell us what the reality is? Now, most of the answers, which we don't get from the Basa data, we could get them if we have a look just nearby, in Eton or Bakoko or Douala, but we don't do that. So here again, I think technology can enhance, can add value because we uh, can ag aggregate uh, spaces. I like the, the, the notion of space. Language, uh, you know, uh, uh, languages flow. And if I'm using the term language, it's, it's, it's for lack of a better term. So I think they flow into space. They flow into space. They, are, they do not stagnate somewhere. So if Basa has some cognate, if they won't know, that, that should, it should have, it, there should be some historical and social reason for that. But what do we what do? We do we, what we linguists do with that? We, we don't care. What we want is, you know, clearly formatted grammars that would collate with theories, Chomskyan, Saussurians, and this is where you are a good a big linguist. If you can come up with something that works for these theories, then it's okay. What about addressing the social reality that is there behind, in, in front of our eyes? So I think we have to rethink the whole thing by exactly expanding our perspective to really, uh, I don't know, try to map linguistics to social reality. Linguistics are not be an enterprise that is separate from the social life of the people. That doesn't make sense. Take, talk about uh, uh, stories, like, you know, tales, everything. Go from Basa to Ewondo, right to, I'm speaking right now from Bertua in the East region. This is where, this is where I work. So we have languages that are like Maka, um, bon bon, if you go um, maybe a little bit further in the East, but you find proverbs, stories that speak to you as a basta. This, this cannot be a fact of, uh, let's say chance, there, there is, and 
I, I don't want to sound very passionate. I'm, I'm sorry if I'm, I'm a little bit passionate, but sometimes you need to be passionate uh, about these things. Yeah. I think we are all appreciating your passion in this topic. It's wonderful. <laughs> Uh, and we have a couple of comments, uh, Lilian, I think, referring to your talk about uh, languages not being bounded and flowing. She says, very true. I'm seeing the same thing with Brassfield's languages. Yeah. Uh, and Akwabome comments that you're, you're being blunt but factual about the funding for language documentation. Yeah. And I wonder if you could talk a little bit about your desires in the coming decade for how funding and determination of language goals in, in your best case scenario, how would that go during the international decade of indigenous languages? Um, yes, thank you. I, I, may, I may sound very, uh, I, I may be betraying a very, uh, a bias, towards technology. Of course, technology, and when I'm talking about digital technologies, uh, digital technologies are not everything. But uh, my experience with, the, with, the, uh, with technology has taught me that this is something that we need to invest in. Uh, we need to invest in machine learning to, um, you know, speech recognitions. This is the future. This is where the world is going towards. This is, these are the services which we are using. And these are solutions which are likely to catch up with many centuries of, of, of just nothing, of nothing happening. Um, the reason I'm saying this is that I've been applying some um, machine learning techniques to, lang to language transcription, for, to you know, language documentation, you go and record, then you come try to, you know, add value to your data transcription. And all of us here, I think all of us here have experience with transcription, but I've seen a leap into, you know, a very, it has, machine learning has made, has, has, has made a big difference because now that I've trained some data, a model in, in Bati, Bati being one of the tongues uh, around the Basa uh, community, now I'm able to automatically transcribe this data with 50% accuracy. Yeah, this is, this is not like English or French, but this is something. And just imagine what we could, we could do with speech recognition, what we could do with uh, speech synthesis. These are things that we should invest in. I think we should also invest in uh, community radios. Radios still have a very powerful uh, impact on people. Most people in the villages listen to the radio. We should go and maybe invest in training so that linguistics or the work on language, I don't, maybe not linguistics, but work on language should also include these, uh, this aspect. How, 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 can, how do we build community mobilizers? How do we build community activists that can help set up a radio where, you know, stories will be broadcast. I said maybe YouTube radios, anything that is likely to revive, bring language to where people are and people are moving to the cities and language are left in the village. So the only way we can bring languages from the village to the cities, and this is not the, we, we, we will not reverse that, that movement. I'm not a dreamer, so let's bring language to where people are. Now everybody is having, playing, learning with their mobile phones. Let's get the languages where people are, where they are playing. And I think this is 
very critical to the future technology and training and that also uh, implies training of course so that we africans are able to develop these tools not all waiting for the same fancy application that is going to be delivered by big companies who don't care about basa or what african languages thank you yeah that's a, that's a really powerful statement um and i think we have a comment from friedrika uh echoing what you said about linguistics uh she says i think descriptive linguistics language documentation and typology are much more conservative and structuralist in this regard. Sociolinguistics and anthropological linguistics have long questioned language boundaries and understand them as social constructs that reveal social identities. Totally agree. Well, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, we're, we're coming up on a bit after our time. And if anyone else has any questions, we really encourage you to share them here in the in the chat. But Emmanuel, uh, is there any way you would like people to be able to contact you after the talk, uh, if they have questions? Uh, sure, I, I can I can um, uh, write my do I have the possibility of writing the chat? I think so. And if not, I will just drop your email in the chat if that's okay. Oh, oh. Okay, please. Uh, oh, I can I can drop it. Yeah, I, I can drop it. No, so just send me an email at any time. Um, yeah, should be it. So this is my email, and yeah. Awesome. And uh, let's let's have a big digital round of applause for Emmanuel. Thank you so much. This talk was an absolute joy to listen to. We really appreciate. Thank you, it. Anna. Thank yeah. you all. Uh, <laughs> Can Paul interpret? Can I end in Basa? Yeah, yeah no turn problem. Interpretation back on. Okay. Uh, let me choose Basa. Me ensumbul kundeti ana longni bijogwe bison gobso na mayega. Inyo le abinis njelle. Me quilis, may ye must say, Haki me, may ye must say, Nule, men no rale, but so also will bem. Yaboa must say, Longi jam among len. Longi beba was sooner, ne never, Nule Murabal and Nole, Mempor de Bassa, a cale bon, Hala hula me yom, de Nilone emble. Ne Nemla King was so old to hold them. The men no one born a parlak, the king was so old to hold them born emble. Member Nemle, Diga Kunde Bantung, Diga Kunde Nirna. In you holos ning, hop yenning. The beba, the ning be in my hot and pot of my hop miss, the ning be. John, the lama holale ning. Ibalong ng kong si wosuna di di sal hala ng kunde tibi maiga. Thank you so much, Emmanuel. It's been a joy. Uh, and I want to thank everyone for being here with us this morning or evening, wherever you are. Uh, and encourage you to tune in in about three and a half hours for our next talk from Dr. Larry Kimura, one of the co-founders of the Language Nest System in Hawaii. Uh, but thank you again, Emmanuel. This was an absolute pleasure. Uh, thank you so much for sharing your insights and your knowledge with us today and your language. Uh, and we will see you all soon. Take care, everyone. Thank you.